before there even was a Central Park, the iconic New York City carriage horses have been parked along what is now Central Park South, delighting tourists of all ages. Delilah was delightful. But not everyone is a fan of this equine setup, especially animal advocacy group NYCLASS. It's just a nightmare for these horses stuck on Central Park South day and night under the blazing sun. Today, the de Blasio administration announced staging areas for the city's more than 200 horses would be moved off the street. Horses in traffic is a bad idea. And inside Central Park. They'll be running the same routes they've ever run. Uh, this is just a smarter way to go about it. Central Park is shaded and much cooler. It's a car-free environment. As if it's not sunny with pavement in the park. You know, I mean, that's just stupid. Christina Hansen says the move has nothing to do with protecting horses and everything to do with abolishing their industry. And what the city is proposing to do is to bury us in the park where tourists and other people who want to use our services can't see us. Carriage drivers say moving all the horses inside Central Park will actually kill their business and make Central Park South a lot more dangerous for everyone else. We are a traffic calming device. The taxis and the Uber drivers and everybody knows that there are horses here on Central Park South, which means they drive slower, they drive more cautiously, and it's going to turn this into just a, a speedway here as well as destroy the historic character of the street. Hansen believes this is the mayor's way of exacting revenge on an industry he's long promised to do away with and fulfilling a campaign promise to NYCLASS. Hansen promising carriage drivers have no intention of seeing this change implemented without a fight. On Central Park South, Jessica Moore, CBS2 News.